There we go. Thanks, Paul. Appreciate that. It feels pretty nice. Hooked up right away in the morning. Today we're fishing with Paul Johnson from River Bend's Resorts and the walleye in and got a big sauger to start today. <laughs> Thanks for the grab. You shot that one out right away. <laughs> That's like a I, nice fish. Like, like I said, folks, we're up here on Lake of the Woods fishing with uh, River Bend's Resorts today and uh, going to catch some walleye, some saugers and share with you what they have to offer. Nice, Paul. Ooh, that looks like a good one. Ooh, get him. Walleye. Trying to stick me. Oh, another big sauger. I thought that one was a walleye. Healthy. We're, we're out uh, mid-December right now. You guys get got a good start to the season. You guys what usually run December well into March on a normal winter, huh? Typical seasons, yeah, usually from beginning of December all the way through the end of March, all based on ice conditions. Sure. But yeah, this is the early ice season. It's on. Yeah, and you guys... You basically, your crew follows that fish. You start out early up in the shallow water, and as the season progresses, you move on out. That's true, yep. Then walleyes follow them shiners upriver, and then we, they slowly progress out into the deeper depths through the winter season, and we just trail them around, right on out there. That's a beauty right there. Let's get another one. Oh, you're on fire, little guy. You can be better, Paul. There you go. <laughs> oh, that is fun. You know, you get to watch that fish work on the flash or come on up. This first ice stuff is great. It's great all year long. There you go, nice little walleye. You guys are set up too when you, you go out early, you can get people out easy, huh? Yeah, transportation, you know, early ice will run our light, light ice rigs, people haulers, which are also heated. So you get to go from the warm cabin to a warm uh, transportation rig out to the warm fish house. Once the season gets going, you're on uh, plowed roads out here then basically? Yep, we're on plowed roads. You can either drive your own vehicle out if you like that comfort, or we can continue to haul you out. Uh, then we transition into bombers yep. when we start moving north further. Yep. However they need to get at the fish, they can do it here. There's another one down there. Get them. There you go, Paul. Come on up. Oh, beauty. Yeah, when that bobber got popped, it got popped. That's a fatty. Well, that's a beautiful fish, a great example. A little too big to keep. We're going to have to let that one go, but that's why people love to come up here. When you're coming up, you've got a lot of different options for packages too, don't you? We do, yeah. Between yep. the Walleye Inn and the resort, you can come up on any time frame, any budget that, that's going to work for you. we got great packages that range from one night, one day of fishing, oh, yeah. up to four nights, three days, five nights, four days, whatever fits your budget, your time frame to come on up here and fish this this awesome fishery. Yeah, and you can actually do the full service packages at the resort where you got the meals, but you can also do it at the hotel where you come out and fish by yourself or stay at the hotel, save a little money and actually get the day houses or the rental houses that way, right? And still do the same package with meals, uh, all inclusive from your breakfast, lunch, dinners, uh, from the time you arrive to the time you depart, transportation, lodging, everything's all included sure. in the package pricing. And if you don't want to go to shore, they got sleeper houses too. Yeah, everyone loves the rough it on the ice. Let's get another one of those. Woohoo, the bobber's going down. That's always fun to see. Nice sock. There you go. Weather changes up here just about as fast as the bite. That's, uh, you know, Paul's got, they got a great social media. He, you can check in on their website there and keep track of what's going on, don't you? And each day the bite changes. The sun comes up, the sun goes down, the cloud comes in. But with social media, what we've been able to do is just keep an instantaneous report of what the fish have been doing. Yep. You know, where the guides are moving the houses, uh, you know, what's been working for jigs, for minnows. It's just a great way to, to keep everyone in tune almost instantaneously. He might be one that we'd like to have on the dinner plate tonight. Sauger. He'd fry up good though. That's one of the things you could do up there. You've been doing a lot of work in the bar, haven't you? We did, yeah. We uh, completed that. We got a brand new remodel lodge uh, with the bar and the restaurant. Great menu. Uh, bring your fish in even. We'll fry it sure. up, throw some sides on there. Yep. Real versatile, uh, great atmosphere. You'll, you'll really like it. Pretty yep. modern. It's a great amenity to have for us when people come up for oh, that yeah. all-inclusiveness. I mean, once you get up here, you don't have to go far. If you're a great day of fishing, you get to go have some fun and uh, enjoy some cold ones with your friends. We'll uh, throw that one in the bucket and have that as a sandwich, huh? Yep, got him, got him. There she is, there she is. She's in the hole, right there. Get her, get her, get her. Grab that fish. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Right there is why you come up the Lake of the Woods and River Bend's resorts, huh? Nice fish, Chris. That is a beauty, boy. She was tugging and tugging and tell you what, I wanted to hold my breath the whole time. <laughs> tell you what, if people want to come up and catch one of these, Paul, how do they do it? You can go to our website. All their information's on there, riverbendsresorts.com. You can call us, 1-800-292-3084, or check us out on any of our social medias. Oh, I am so happy. Thank you. We only <laughs> had like four or five tries at one of these today, and we finally got one. Folks, I tell you what, it's a great time. For Paul Johnson, I'm Greg Jones, Midwest Outdoors. We'll be right back. Barely fits down that hole. <laughs>